Scientists now propose that the moon is much older than previously thought, with a surprising history of violent volcanism that reshaped its crust multiple times. These discoveries challenge long-standing assumptions about the moon's formation and evolution, while also offering tantalizing clues about the early solar system. In this video, we will discuss this groundbreaking news and unravel the science behind it, why it matters, and what it reveals about the moon's fiery past. New research published in Nature places the moon's age between 4.43 and 4.51 billion years. This challenges previous estimates, which ranged from 4.35 to 4.51 billion years. The findings hinge on precise analysis of lunar rock samples, particularly zircon crystals, which are known for their exceptional resilience to heat and pressure. Zircon isotopes serve as nature's timekeepers, revealing clues about when the moon's crust solidified. Remarkably, while most lunar rocks suggest a younger age for the crust, around 4.35 billion years, the zircons tell a different story, hinting at an older moon beneath a geologically reset surface. The process of dating lunar rocks is rooted in radiometric techniques, where scientists measure the decay of radioactive isotopes like uranium and thorium into stable elements. This decay acts as a clock, but it only starts ticking when the rock cools enough to lock its isotopic composition. The intense volcanic activity that followed the moon's formation likely reset this clock multiple times, erasing evidence of earlier ages in most samples. This explains the apparent contradiction between younger crustal ages and older zircons. These findings are critical because they refine our understanding of the moon's timeline and its place in the solar system's early history. The moon's formation is believed to have been triggered by a colossal collision between the young Earth and a Mars-sized protoplanet named Theia. The debris from this impact coalesced to form the moon, initially covered by a molten ocean of rock. Over millions of years, this magma ocean cooled, and the moon's crust began to solidify. However, the new research suggests that this process was far from straightforward, involving multiple phases of melting and remelting that reset the geological clock. Understanding the moon's age is more than a matter of curiosity. It helps scientists piece together the timeline of planetary formation in our solar system, shedding light on how Earth's environment evolved to support life. One of the most striking revelations from the recent research is the extent of volcanic activity that shaped the moon's early history. When the moon first formed, it was much closer to Earth, orbiting only a small fraction of the distance it is today. This closeness created strong tidal forces that generated friction inside the moon, producing intense heat. This heat caused massive volcanic activity that melted the moon's crust multiple times, turning its surface into a fiery, chaotic landscape. The closest modern analogy to this phenomenon is Jupiter's moon Io, the most volcanically active body in the solar system. Io's elliptical orbit around Jupiter generates tidal forces that heat its interior, driving continuous volcanic eruptions. Similarly, the young moon experienced tidal heating as its orbit evolved from a more elliptical to a nearly circular path. This heating melted much of the moon's mantle, causing magma to rise to the surface or remain trapped beneath, reshaping its structure. Lunar rock samples and surface observations provide compelling evidence for this volcanic history. The moon's maria, dark basaltic plains visible from Earth, are remnants of ancient lava flows that filled large impact basins. However, the new research suggests that volcanic activity was not limited to these basins. Instead, heat from the interior liquefied large portions of the crust, creating conditions where even the toughest minerals, like zircon, struggled to survive. This phase of volcanism was likely a key factor in resetting the moon's geological clock. As magma cooled, it crystallized into new rock layers, effectively erasing evidence of older formations. In areas where magma did not reach the surface, heat-resistant zircons remained intact, preserving clues about the moon's earlier history. 
This duality explains why lunar samples often present conflicting ages. The scale of this volcanic activity has not only altered the moon's crust, but also contributed to its chemical evolution. Volcanism likely released gases trapped in the mantle, creating a transient atmosphere that may have influenced surface conditions. One of the enduring puzzles in lunar science has been the discrepancy between the moon's apparent age and its surface features. For example, the relatively small number of craters on the moon's surface suggests a younger age, as older surfaces would have accumulated more impacts over time. The new findings provide a compelling explanation. Lava flows from intense volcanism filled early impact basins, erasing evidence of these collisions, and giving the surface a younger appearance. Another mystery lies in the composition of the moon's mantle, which differs significantly from Earth's. While the moon and Earth share a common origin in the Theia collision, the moon's interior appears to have undergone additional chemical differentiation. Researchers suggest that repeated melting events allowed certain elements to escape from the mantle into the moon's iron-rich core, altering its composition. These processes are consistent with the intense volcanic activity described in the study. These findings also have implications for future lunar exploration, as space agencies plan missions to return to the moon. Understanding its volcanic history will be crucial for selecting landing sites and studying the subsurface. Regions with intact zircons could provide valuable insights into the moon's earliest days, while areas with extensive lava flows might reveal more about its volcanic evolution. Finally, the study underscores the interconnectedness of planetary science. By examining the moon's history, researchers gain insights into the broader processes that govern planetary formation and evolution. This knowledge not only deepens our understanding of the Earth-Moon system, but also informs our exploration of other worlds, from the icy moons of Jupiter to the ancient plains of Mars. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the moon's turbulent history. Stay curious and keep exploring. As we prepare for the next era of lunar exploration, this research reminds us of the importance of looking to the past to inform the future.